Let's turn to the government. What do you think they got right and what did you think they got wrong in the first phase of the crisis? They got it actually right in one of the first statements where they said uh, that uh, they singled out the aviation industry as being, you know, the industry that is probably the, the, the hardest to be impacted by this. They got that right. But they didn't necessarily follow up that up with actions, mm -hmm. as many people in this industry w will say. Uh, and there, and and what do you mean by that? Well, you know, the the support mechanisms can be divided into different categories. You have financial support. You have, um, you know, restrictions that are being put in place, and then also the general. Um, how, how do you say it in English, but the verbatim, the way they articulate the communication, the communication yeah. about this industry. You know, you, you would have had, you know, both Macron and, and Merkel talk about they would never let their, you know, airline fail. They will do whatever they can, even to the point where they say that they're going to be around to compete hard after this. It's not exactly the type of approach and, and the communication that's been sent out from this government to, to this industry. When it comes on the... Well, we didn't hear anything, really. Well, we didn't hear anything after that first statement that they recognized that, look, you know, mm. airline industry is the, you know, the industry is going to be the hardest hit. And we went first in to this crisis. And it looks like now we're going to be the last one to come out first of First in, last out. First in, last out. And then you mm. have the financial support and... and uh, and, uh, you know, I'm not going to break it down in numbers, but we haven't achieved, we haven't received the same level of support that you would see that other airlines has. And, and that's just pure. On the continent. On, on yeah. the continent. They've yeah. had big bailout packages. Big bailout they? packages. You know, Air, Air France, 11 billion. Uh, Lufthansa, 11 billion. Um, and, and we have got the furlough. Which is about a hundred million, and we, we're generous for that. But that's something that's been delivered mm -hmm. to to a number of countries. We, we've that access to CCFF, uh, 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 which is a Bank of England facility um, on a commercial, you know, uh, paper. Um, and that was also something that was available for all companies who had investment grade. Um, the UK EF, which is actually backed up by the government, but they're taking collateralization of, in terms of aircrafts in the company, mm. and the money is coming from banks. So there's yes. no taxpayers' money into that, and that would equate to about the two billion. And don't get me wrong, I'm, I'm not, you're not ungrateful. We recognize that, but it doesn't stack up to what's been done elsewhere. Yeah. And then, of course, you, you then have the, the restrictions that is in place, where it's actually been made illegal here to travel. You don't see that in, in other European countries.